How you doing? Um, I'm going to go over a superset today. I'm going to do three exercises. Um, the first one I'm going to do is a tricep dip just on the bench here, double arm. Um, the second one I'm going to get into is a skull crusher laying down on my back here on the bench. And, and the third exercise is cross body, similar to a skull crusher except you're going cross your body. Um, on the last two exercises, the skull crusher and cross body, I'm going to do this tempo. So on tempo, let's say I do 3-3-3 three, three, three tempo. That's three seconds down, three second pause, three seconds up, or vice versa. You can go three seconds up, three second pause, three seconds down, and then with the other exercise as well. Make sure on tempo that you keep that tempo, that 3-3-3 three, three, three tempo. Um, find a weight that's manageable that you can do somewhere between 8 and 10 reps. Um, and then, you know, if your arms start giving out on one, of the, one or other of the movements, just make sure that you can use that other arm to really guide you through it. Keep our legs straight out in front of us. Try to get about as far as you can down there. Get your glutes as close to the ground without touching. This, this first one just a good little warm up. Do about 15, 20 reps. And then you're going to go straight into that skull crusher. Doing both movements on each, on, on one arm before you move over to the next. Three seconds down, three seconds up, three second pause. Keep your tricep fully, fully flexed the whole time. Tempo training, in my opinion, is one of the toughest. You don't have to use a lot of weight, and it's just killer. We're using like 15, 20 pounds, and it feels like about 300. So I'm going to do cross body now. This is where it gets tough. Try to keep that tempo. You're going to want to, especially when you start getting fatigued, you're going to want to go a little bit faster. But just try to keep that tempo, use that other arm to guide you. Good. So you do the other arm as well. And uh, great, great pump. Um, something, something I typically like doing um, either mid to later in the routine. Um, typically with any movement that I do, I try to do my first and second movement, if it be chest or, or, or uh, legs, a heavier movement like a leg press, super heavy, uh, bench a little bit heavier than you regularly go, a little bit less of reps, and then I get into like a tempoed thing that I did there, superset, drop set type deal with more high intensity reps. So enjoy your, enjoy your workout and thanks for watching.